Hello everyone and welcome back. I'm Tiffany from Large Family Love. I have had several people ask about our egg salad recipe, so I figured I'm making it today. I'm gonna go ahead and share it with you guys. I hope you enjoy. Right now, I'm going to put a bunch of these in the Instant Pot to do hard boiled eggs and eggs for egg salad. are done so I'm just gonna go ahead and release the pressure sorry my dishwasher is the loudest thing in the world that's releasing when it's done I'm gonna go ahead and take all the eggs out and put them in a bowl of cold water and they're done so I'm just gonna go ahead and scoop them out one by one and put them into the ice water well, cold water. Usually I put ice in it, but our ice maker's broken and I don't have any ice made. So, can't do that. them rest in the water. I never really time it. I don't know how long they're supposed to sit in here. I just leave them in here while I do other things and when I'm done I come back and I drain the water and I peel all the eggs. So now it's been quite some time. I'm not even sure how long it's been and I'm gonna go ahead and dump the water out of these and start peeling them. peeled now what I like to do is just give these a good rinse because sometimes like little tiny pieces of shell will still be on there so I like to just rinse them off and make sure that no one bites into a shell now since I'm saving some of these for just hard-boiled eggs for the week I'm gonna go ahead and put them just in a bag I like to keep them peeled and not in the shell, that way they're easily accessible and ready to go. I can just reach in the fridge and grab them for lunches, for snacks, for breakfast, whatever. A lot of you have asked what I actually put in it, which is the whole reason for the video. Nothing fancy, I just do mayonnaise, relish, salt, and pepper. And I did have a matching one of these, these cute little mason jars, and the other day I reached in the cabinet and knocked it, the pepper one down and it broke. So now I'm in the market for these again because I love these. So I gotta find another set so I can put the pepper in it. So now I'm just going to, I have a little egg slicer. I'm gonna go ahead and slice up the eggs, put them back in the bowl and then mix. Once again, I never measure, so I'm sorry. I don't have measurements for you, but you'll be able to see, I guess, kind of what I do. I just eyeball everything. I have this really cool egg slicer. It's from KitchenAid. You just open it up put the egg in and slice it and then pull it out and slice it the other way. So it slices this way and this way on the egg. Mine is broken, but it still works. Like a couple of these string things have come off. Um, I should probably get a new one, but you know. Here's all the eggs cut up. I'm just gonna go ahead and add some salt. Eggs need salt, I think, anyway. Add some pepper. I 
I add some relish. And again, I just eyeball it. Three big old scoops. It depends on how many eggs are in there as to how much I add. And again, same for the mayonnaise. And I need some more mayonnaise. And then I just mix it around. And if it looks like it needs more mayonnaise, I'll add more. And if it looks like it needs more um, relish, I'll add more. Really, you just eyeball it, taste it, see what you like, and figure it out from there. But this looks good. And this is what it looks like when it's all finished. And what I'm gonna go ahead and do now is put a little bit in this tiny bowl for Gary to take to work tomorrow. And then I'm gonna put the rest of it in this bowl to keep in the fridge. Well, I got three bowls out of it. It was too much for those, so I just went ahead and did another one. So he'll have egg salad twice this week for his lunch. Um, but that's it, simple as can be. Hope you guys enjoyed, hope you got some information on how I make the egg salad. Sorry I don't give specifics, but I don't ever measure really anything in the kitchen, so it's really hard for me to come up with like an actual recipe. Um, but there you go, let me know if you guys make it, if you enjoy it, whatever. Hope everyone has a really great week, bye. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and enjoy these other videos we have coming up for you. Also, you can turn on the red bell notifications so you're notified of every new video we post. Thank you so much.